Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Pikmin 3 playthrough. We are still in the extra videos. We're probably going to be in the extra videos for quite a while though, so do not be surprised. Um, but we're going through Olimar's comeback, one of the side stories of Pikmin 3 Deluxe. Uh, we're currently on day number 4 out of 10. I'm uh, going to do another two days today, more than likely. And, uh, well, it looks like we're going to find our first rocket part, which should be interesting. Uh, before we do, let's look at the outline. Mission log day four. We found the most important part of the ship, the main engine. It's a bit dirty from exposure to the elements, but it should still function. Now to consider how to transport it back to base without any indigenous creatures damaging it. So, yeah, we need to actually... Uh, get a rocket part for once. That that should sound very, very nostalgic here. Uh, first part found. Don't bother lifting that ship part until you've cleared a route back, including bridges. I don't want to see any bite marks on Hakatate Freight property. Well, what if I bite it? Maybe I thought there was chocolate inside. You never know. You gotta, ta you gotta, you gotta test these things. Let's do this. Okay, guys. Hope you're ready for some awesome Pikmin 1 light gameplays. We're for the first time in what seems like a long time, I'm actually going to be collecting some rocket parts, which is pretty interesting. Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to, first of all, throw Louie against the wall, because that's funny. Uh, but no, actually, we're going to be throwing Louie right here. This will force him to pick up all of these yellow Pikmin um, plants in a row, which is kind of nice. And then you're going to start working on these, Olimar. Then while you're doing that... Louis is going to do some work on these little mushrooms, just to kind of get these out of the way. I think they'll immediately start working on, yeah, they'll start working on all the other ones too. And I want them to work on that while I'm picking up these guys. So I have a couple of other numbers to work with. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get these guys nectared up. And then we're going to go back over here. We're going to use our blues that we just got. And we're going to do a little bit of combat after I also get these guys nectared up. See, them being Nectar up should also help them, again, fight a little more. So again, the important thing to do with Wally Wogs here, at least in this game, as I've noticed... ...is you want to wait till uh, they actually touch the ground before you charge. Because if you sometimes they can delay their descent, which can be which can kind of throw you off a little bit, so you gotta be really careful with that. Okay, so we're, while they're working on that, we're gonna start working on some other stuff. Yeah, I feel like you don't really need to create any Pikmin in this particular mission. This is a perfect mission where you can basically just try to do what you need to do with just the numbers that they give you from the start. So definitely try to do that. This could be... Okay, this is kind of a bad situation where they're actually together. Doing that, I'm gonna go back to you and start working on this next part. Um, let me get rid of these guys. 
guys. Okay, perfect. See, and now I think this entire section is kind of taken care of with enemies, so with that done, we can actually focus on repairing the red side of the bridge, so that's what we're going to do next. So you guys are going to do this, and do this. I should actually be... Oh, not quite all of them. Almost all of them. Okay, well, let's just keep going. Um, don't think you have to worry about uh, this little octopus guy either, so that's nice. Um, I think we, I think we're actually in a position where we can do this, though. Um, so obviously we have some bridge pieces here, too. Um, actually I'm not gonna do this because I feel like that might take up too much time. Let me get some more bodies here. Or more Pikmin, rather. Let's take care of these fools. Oh, oh, thank god that blue Pikmin was there. Because the thing I do want to keep in mind here is... Um, I believe the um, metal for this one is actually uh, dependent on um, how many Pikmin you have and you keep alive. So be very careful with that. Like, don't make sure you don't take any deaths. I mean, normally you don't want to try to anyway, but I mean, compared to like the other missions we've done, like you definitely don't want to take deaths here. Okay, so we got rid of these guys. So while these guys are gone, we can start worrying about the other things we need to get done. So let's start getting these done now. And while you guys are done, I'm actually going to send you back to the ship part. There we go. I'm going to go back through here. Focus on this other one. I don't think we actually need to go over that way. I think we can actually ignore that for now. So I'm going to send you guys... Uh, well, actually, I'll, I'll keep you here for now. Actually, no, I'll follow you guys. That way I can call you off when you're done. Damn it. I love how we're just pushing that guy back. At least trying to take the bridge pieces back. Oh, no! Damn it. Take that back, then. Sorry for distracting you. That, that, that can be an annoyance of this. Accidentally sending one back when he did not intend to. Okay, so I don't think we have any... Okay, there's no bodies until that next gate, so we can kind of keep things moving anyway. So you put that down, the bridge is done, you go straight here, go back to Louie, and you guys can start carrying this rocket part. And I'll send you guys also to where you guys are going. So now we're going to start working on finishing this up. We don't have any yellows, but that shouldn't be a big deal. I mean, you can defeat these guys without yellows. It's just safer with yellows. Oh, well, we have yellows. <laughs> no, 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 no. Come on! I think we're still fine for Platinum, because I, I don't think you... I think you can lose some, just not all. Which is really, really annoying that I lost some right there.
come on. Knock the gate down. And we did it, okay. So yeah, I think we still we got a platinum medal, but uh Again, I guess I'm not entirely sure if it's time based or if it's Pikmin death based. Really hard to say. Okay, well let me let me look at the top five here. See, my last attempt was better, probably because I had like a little I was a little faster with getting rid of those last few enemies. I think I also had just more yellows too, so that was another reason probably. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Well, that's that one, pretty much. We got one of the parts, but the going won't be easy from here. Louie and I are thinking of splitting up to find a way through the next region. I worry about him going off on his own. Maybe there's a way to keep an eye on him from a distance. We'll work it out, I suppose. Or else. Or else you will die. I mean, you're on a very dangerous planet. That could be a very real possibility, so... <laughs> Can't overlook that completely. Okay, so let's go ahead and move on to the next one. We have day number five. Uh, we got, ooh, battle enemies again. So what are we doing this day? While tracking down the signal from another part, I somehow got separated from Louis. I found him before too long, but he was on the other side of a body of water. Rather than risk a crossing, we decided to split up and look for somewhere that we can meet up. I'll best keep an eye out for indigenous creatures while I search. So... Um, team monster hunt, battle enemies. Those Pikmin are com company property, not yours. If a fellow employee needs them, I expect you to share. How else are you supposed to get my treasure out of that cave? Well, dude, first of all, they're not your property. I don't know why you would think that they were. But, whatever. Let's do it. Okay, so we have another uh, monster battling day. I think this one's uh, the Garden of Hope. I also see a bold bear wandering around, which I don't really like, but we'll do what we can anyway. Review. So we need rock Pikmin and flying Pikmin. Okay. Um, yeah, Louie, he has rocks. Hooray for rocks. Well, at least rocks will make this part easier. And I guess for this one it makes sense to go ahead and get these. you're getting those let me go ahead and throw these across so yeah this will just basically be a uh, test and just uh, switching numbers around as you need them and as you see fits which I, th I do think is kind of a interesting challenge I think it does make kind of a interesting way to go about this mission for sure oh, okay. These guys back over here. Gotta break this open. Hell yeah. Yeah, break open the wall. Boom. Hey, it's a crab boy. Thankfully, crab is really easy to fight with uh, rock pickman. Because you can break the... Uh, you can break the crab claw, which basically eliminates the biggest danger of the crab. Okay, so we beat all these guys. That's good. Now we need wing Pikmin, which we can get from that side. And I'm trying to think if we need anything else. 
I think we do need more battlers on that side, I think. I'm just trying to make sure that I'm doing this properly before I... We're actually not too far from being done, believe it or not. <laughs> this is really not too hard of a mission. I'm gonna go ahead and just throw all of them over. I think it just makes sense too, honestly. Okay, so what are we gonna deal with on this side? We got... There's the flyers. But we're not going oh, okay, so we have this guy. I guess I never really thought, but yeah, that guy's a flying enemy, so. so yeah, Wing Pikmin would be effective in this guy. Guess I never really put two and two together that, yeah, that's right, he is a flying enemy. Anything over here? Whoa, oh, shoot. Damn, I was not ready for that. Okay, well, you know what? I'm gonna take care of this guy first, because... I don't think I lost any wing pick though, so that's good. But yeah, that did kind of take me off guard, that that rock started homing in on my pick in there. Why am I not plucking? I didn't approve of that. Okay, so... That is another place where I can throw a Pikmin over, so I'm gonna do that. left. We know that the bull bear is coming too, so. But we also have all those sprays that we can also use for that as well, so I'm not really too worried about the bull bear at this point. Got rid of you. There's no enemies in that direction. 
So, let's go ahead and start working on the remaining tools that we have. still two enemies left though oh shoot there are still two enemies left ooh hope I'm ready to fight these I should be fine but hold on it's over here what exactly does this do Oh, that's a way to get to the other side. If for any reason you want to do that, which... I don't really see why you would. Okay, well, let's just ignore that then. I feel like I'm wasting time. I think we still got this, it's just a kind of waste of a little extra time, so I thought these were the only enemies we have left. I'm surprised this wall's taken as long as it is with how many Pikmin I have working on it. Okay. Keep going, let's keep going. Oh, it's just a whip cracking bullboard. Okay. Um, let's do this. Also, whip cracking, I think it's like. I don't think it's called that necessarily. Okay, well that takes care of that one. We did the thing. Hundred percent complete. That's my favorite percentage completed. <laughs> I know, I'm a dork. Uh tough five. Let's see. Oh wow, I just barely missed out on my other one. I think on my first attempt, I was just more focused on, like, what I had left, and I knew there was a cavern, so I was able to approach that a lot better, so that's probably what it was. Didn't have that stumble where it's like, oh, wait, I'm not done yet. And yeah, if I maybe put the time and dedication to that, I could probably maximize that pretty efficiently. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for that one, and I think that's going to do it for this video, too, because... Yeah, that's two missions, so... Our splitting up strategy worked better than I had anticipated. Sharing Pikmin freely back and forth was all the proof we need to show how much we've grown into a fully functioning team. I underestimated Louie, I admit. I shouldn't have doubted his commitment to the mission. No, you should have. <laughs> Remember, he's the one that put Hakatate in, like, debt in the first place. So, it's all his fault. I'll never forgive him for that. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap that up there. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys uh, next time when we basically start working on the second half of Olimar's comeback. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then. Later, folks.